Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's my great pleasure to welcome you here at this workshop. My name is Leon Ziesel. I'm president of the Inan Association. Uh, I would like to share just a few basic information about the Inan Association with you. Inan stands for European Nuclear Education Network. And we were formed in the early 2000, 2003, uh, because there were some signs that nuclear workforce is uh, decaying, that we will have in the future some problems with the nuclear workforce. Now, about, what, 13 years later, it's clear that the fathers of Inan Association, the professors which were there when we were established, are actually more or less all retired. So we uh, are seeing uh, the successors today, and we are in a way happy that most of the professors who were there around uh, were retired, but they had the successors. At that time, at that time it seems that also nuclear education can uh, kind of decay in Europe. Now, uh, today, uh, in an association um, is an establishment which hosts actually 90% of European universities with nuclear programs. And you would be surprised to hear that there is no more than roughly 60 universities in Europe who has some nuclear programs. It's roughly 5% of, of European universities uh, who can still teach something in nuclear. We are proud to have more or less all of them on board. And also um, in the association we have uh, research centers and industry. Especially I'm proud to say that Westinghouse and Areva are members of the in an association. Uh, we have nuclear communities embedded. We started with nuclear engineering communities. So these are the guys who would build and operate the nuclear power plants. And then we have uh, waste disposal people embedded in the, in the association, radiation protection people, fusion people, nuclear security people, security from the sense of proliferation viewpoint, if you want. And we also have uh, nowadays uh, joining, uh, slowly joining the VVR community. VVR is the Russian type reactor which is still operated uh, in uh, uh, a few European countries, including Finland. So uh, with this set, our future uh, vision of INEN is to attract, develop, and to retain uh, talent, new talent to nuclear professions. This is a pretty challenging uh, uh, vision for the time being, but I will also trust that you will help us a little bit because uh, uh, no high tech, including nuclear energy, can run without very good people and very responsible people at the end of the day.